Sometimes you feel like a nut. House Flipper is back. At least I'm going to give it another try. And the reason why I'm saying that is... It seems like... Uh, actually, that's not where I want to go. The only person... I seem to sell to lately... Where is he? Where is he? Is this dude right here? Look at all the houses he buys off me. So today... <laughs> today... We're going to buy a house and just, I'm not going to, I'm just going to do things out of the ordinary. Don't do things I normally do and maybe we can finally sell to someone else. But, uh, there's 11 houses for purchase, huh? Garage with a bunker. We're buying it. We haven't done a house with a bunker yet, I don't think. So let's dive right into it. Literally, dive right into it. It's a bunker. Uh, any dirt on the outside you need to take care of? Uh, that must be downstairs in the bunker. There's a hole in the bunker. Alright, the outside looks pretty well done. I kind of like it. I kind of like it a lot. Hopefully I can remember the buttons for things. Uh, Alright. A lot of trash to get rid of. And dirt. Oh my god, look at the dirt. Dirt's everywhere. I mean, it's not bad. I mean, for the cleaning tools that we got, we can clean this up in no time. Oh wow, okay, this... Uh, Wait, those are items I can pick up and move? Interesting. Alright, let's start cleaning up some of this dirt so I can tell what's dirt, what's not dirt. Uh, alright, alright, alright. A potential three buyers, huh? And no one I, I've sold to yet, so that, that's a good start. It's a very good start. Where is this dirt? Oh, it's up there. And over here. I, I didn't even pay attention to how much I bought the house for. I saw something in the bunker. So let's see if we, we can get to something different for a change. Which would be very nice. So I can, I can install a rat over in that corner. Uh, Alright, up there. Down here. Oh, on the car itself. Alright. Yeah, let's clean the window. Oh, sure, it's been a while since I've done this. It's going to take me a second to get used to cleaning the windows again. Uh, there's a couple more windows here. Now, this is my first bunker that I've done. But I guess I'll have to wait until I get downstairs and see what uh, the downs Well, not the downstairs, but the bunker area has to offer. But only three potential buyers, apparently. So, got to see what they prefer. Uh, so, it's been a while since I've played. So, a few buttons I'm going to get confused on. Get rid of that, 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 that. Get rid of that as well. That looks like it's in good shape. I think all that we can kind of keep. And the car we'll kind of keep for now. Well, I was trying to sell this stuff. Ah, oh, okay, whatever. It's gone now. It's not much to clean in here. Just uh, see a toilet and oh, it looks like I can do a shower in here. Okay, uh, that door is gonna go because it's terrible. All 
All right, let's start cleaning up some of this mess. Oh, good thing some of this stuff is already stored. Not stored, but stocked. Okay, nothing there. Doesn't look like really much to do in here other than uh, clean up the mess. It looks like I've done a job in here before. Uh, what? Oh, okay. Really? You got people there? Okay. <laughs> uh, people are that, uh, it, it's a game, but yeah, I get it. I get it. Some people don't like cockroaches, so... I still don't get why I'd suck them up with a vacuum. I mean... Uh, fine, I guess. <laughs> Whatever works. Did I get them all? No, there's one. So if we can distinguish what's trash and what's not down here, that would be fantastic. Uh, okay, so that's trash. Okay, that's, that's all gone. Uh, where is this dirt? Uh... There we go. Okay, you're talking that is dirt. Cobwebs. Alright. Uh, what we got in here? Nothing too fancy. So it's kind of a small... Little living area, as a bunker would be. Uh, a shower, sink, and toilet. Alright, so we got like two bathrooms. Wait a minute, where's that cobweb? There it is. So, an entryway. Where, where did I get confused here? Oh, the one upstairs. That's right. Okay. Hmm. Where to begin? Alright. So, I'm just trying to get a feel for the place. Uh, nope. Wrong button. Nope. Wrong button. Wrong button. Bam. And we'll leave that up. So, <laughs> uh, so I think I'm going to start downstairs. If I can take the corner. So you know me, if you've been watching my episodes, I'm going to start in the bathroom. So I'll bring it back when I got something going in here. So I'll see you in a minute. Or a second. Probably more than a minute. taking me forever to pick up this stuff from the shelves and line those up and what ticks me off is I still can't like it's once you get above your shoulders you can't really place on the upper shelves unless you try to jump and get it on the shelf you want and you can't place it exactly where, where you want even then it's yeah it just says oh I can't place it there because why would you want to place it there? Uh, the bathroom is somewhat done. Other than... There we go. Uh, I bought some white paint because I thought I was going to do the ceiling. Alright, can't get in there now. About right. Wrong button. So a little blue with some white tile, mirror, sink. Shower, toilet, toilet paper, halogen lights. Uh, I thought I was going to be able to paint the ceiling, but I uh, can't paint the ceiling. But there's our bunker bathroom. Close that. We'll close that. Now one thing I noticed is you can't really put a sink down here. Ah, lordy lordy. So... 
They're not even like a bed. Put a bed there and a table over here somewhere. I mean, you can't really put a table in here. It's kind of a really small bunker room, if you will. And especially with no place upstairs for like a kitchen or anything like that. I mean, we do have an upstairs bathroom, but I don't know how you would want to make that into a kitchen. Uh, but I think in here for floor tile... Actually, can we go... This is all tile. Yeah, I don't want floor tile. Floor paling and covering. Uh, I'll go with beige carpet. So you can at least, if you're going to be down here and stuck, you're not going to want to be wearing shoes all the time. So we're going to put carpet in here. Nope, 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 nope. Let me off. There we go. And crap. So <laughs> you always, there's always one section you always forget to do, isn't there? Uh, that should be fine. That should be fine. All right, let's see if we can stick a bed down here. Uh, children's space, not a double bed. Bed with drawer. Uh, bedding blue, no, white, orange, navy. No, oh, wow. Let's go white. So they have like some storage underneath the bed. I really wish they could make it so when you get into a corner, it won't go into the wall. One bed. Where's the second one? All right. The first guy didn't really want a bed. I'm like, okay, dude, where do you want to sleep? Where would you like to sleep? Uh, let's see here. How big is this room now? I mean, you can't even really fart in this room and it'll... Okay, how about here? Uh, survival. Where's... Oh, survival right there. Uh, let's see here. Can we stick a generator underneath the stairs? Looks like we can. Okay, they seem to be happy about that. They should be. First aid kit will stick next to the generator. There's another generator. Interesting. Power generator. A lot of different generators. Oh, a double bunk bed. A double bunk bed. I did not know that. Double bunk bed. But some things they haven't really fixed in this game. Like sometimes you click on stuff and it doesn't move. And all of a sudden it just appears and it moves so far. Alright. There's that guy again. One bed. Where's the second one? I went. I got rid of one bed and gave you a bunk bed, dude. What more do you want? What more could you want? Uh, classy table, coffee table, small table. You want a small table. That's, 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 a, that's not the kind of small table I'm thinking of, though. There, that's kind of a table I'm thinking of. Alright, uh, why 
I know one guy is already kind of bitching up a storm. But I'm just going totally different this time. But see, this is why, this is why I don't. This is why the game irritates me some. You get a white table. Then he asks for white stools. And you can see what I'm talking about. You just. Uh, it's just so frustrating. So frustrating. Uh, let me finish up this room and I'll bring it back because now I'm getting a little frustrated again. But. Uh, yeah, I want to paint these walls white while, while you're at it. Just to brighten it up a little bit in here, I think. Okay, so... <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I finished painting in here, white. Put a whole bunch of ceiling lights up. Didn't really matter too much. Uh, put some floor tile in this little cubby room with a shelf. Put some pistols and some M16s in here. Uh, everyone but the girls seemed to like the rifles. Well, I just want to say even the two guys liked the rifles. The girl didn't so much. Boots, no one really cared about. I painted the wall white. And then uh, I started moving here. Put the same tile in. Uh, some propane tanks. They all like that. More energy. Toilet paper, no one cared about. And then I put down two barrels of water. And they were saying, oh yeah, water, we need more, need more, need more. I'm like, okay. I got a hallway in here. I put all these down. Even after I put the last one down, they kept saying, more water, is that it? And I'm thinking to myself, w where where else do I store water for you right now? Uh, I got the upstairs garage. I can take everything out and start storing water up there, I guess. Because uh, I'm kind of getting to be out of room. But in the survival, they seem to really want water... And, uh, and fuel, obviously. I haven't put down any of these yet, but, uh, let's buy a couple of these and see what they say about that. They seem to really care about these canisters, about the gas canisters so far. Where are the gas, gas cylinders? Let me, uh. Of course, I'm not really giving them time right now to say anything, but. Uh, yeah, put the firearms next to the, all the gas tanks and generators. And gas cylinders and whatnot. Now, the one thing they kind of need in here, I would believe. If we go to electronics. They're going to need a TV to keep up to date on, what, on what's going on in the world, right? All right, so one dislike, two likes on that. You know what? How about uh, two of them? One for sports and one for CNN or something. I don't know. Whatever you like to watch. No? Don't, no one cared? No one cared. So I can't really do much more in here because you need to get around to get to the ladder. Can that door clo even close? Not really, but good enough. Uh, we do have a light in here. I really don't mind this tile in here. I mean, there's nothing really wrong with it. And this is just an entryway. So I'm going to leave it the way it is, I think. Which is probably a mistake, but, you know. This game, I am full of mistakes. I, I mean, this game don't really get along too well, it seems like. Uh, so, yeah. So you got entryway with five... Yeah, five water bales, which didn't seem to be enough. Uh, I got a table in here. A couple TVs set to keep up on the news. I really don't have no other place to put... You know, I thought about putting down a, a chair, armchair or something. Can't really do that. Uh, is there a light switch in here? No light switch at all? Uh, okay. Installations. 
actually the door opens on that side so you want the light switch there there we go I'm not gonna put any lights in there because it's really a bunker so it's not made to be like a house all right so that leaves this room up here I think I will put a toilet in here um, it's always good to at least have two toilets I think assemble won't take long to assemble must be getting dark out because uh, any lights in this place come on yeah those lights are just fabulous okay let's put a sink in here as well yeah we'll put this one because we can I expect this house to be a major fail because uh, I'm not good at this game <laughs> there's just some things I don't quite get what some people are looking for whoops wrong buttons all right let's uh let's see ceiling lights and yeah, when I do a bathroom it's really just a quick little one in each little corner especially when it's this small uh, let's put a couple more in because it seems awfully dark in here hey do they fix it so when you probably put ceiling lights back up they don't turn off so you can't see what the heck you're doing let's go all why am I in caps all of a sudden I must have hit that button by fun uh, yes please that's fine all right we need a door uh, we'll just go with a white door Is that where it needs to be because I can't quite tell of course not ah, I wish they just fix the doors to like where they snap in but uh, you know come on close thank you there that looks better alright so let's see what happens if I go back to survival because they kept saying we need more water and now they got nothing to say when I placed the last one downstairs they all said we need more water I just gave him three more water and nothing oh, this game this game is uh, quite frustrating so that's not really considered dirt that's just considered dirt <laughs> okay oh man uh, okay See if I can place this radiator without. Uh, oh, you're gonna let me assemble that without moving anything? That's great. It's the same thing about painting. When you paint the walls, they don't seem to care one way or the other. Nope, nope, nope. Curtains and blinds. Lots of a window blind closed. Well, we're kind of like a. a bunker area, so we want everything closed. Do the same thing here. Uh, 
This house is not meant to be pretty. It's meant to be a bunker, right? Tab, buy, whoops, purchase, assemble. Okay, let's uh, go outside for this. And doors. And knockers. I like knockers. Uh, come on. No. Come on, door. Move. There we go. So finicky. Not bad, not bad. Let's uh, close this garage door because we don't want no one getting in the middle of the night. Part of me thinks I should sell that car, but then again, you know, I think I'll bring some value to the house. Because, you know, my house is just so wonderful. Uh, okay, we need more lights in here. Aziz, light! Uh... I think that's what's in here. So let's put one here, here. Yeah, that's not bad. That's brightening up the place a little bit. So I still don't get it. Downstairs, when I placed the last water bucket, they all said, water, we need more. I placed down three more. No reaction whatsoever. So, yeah, I'm, this game baffles me. It baffles me, I tell you. Uh, part of me wants to clean this up, but most of the time they could care less. Uh, you know what? You can go over here for now. Because I'm going to sell that dirty table. Here. Not curtains and blind cupboards. Oh, come on. Close enough. And it's getting really laggy as well, all of a sudden. Is it because I've got too many placeables down or something? That's new. Um, I'll take that downstairs. We don't want that up here. Uh, pardon me, do I even want to paint this up here? Wall tiles. Let's go to wall, wall panels. Let me guess, this won't even match. Come on. Pick it up. So the ones you buy in the store are not like the ones that are on the house. That bugs me. place another door up here come on uh, 
All right, let's pick up this microwave. Yeah, whatever it is, upstairs in the garage, I come down here to lag, this goes bye-bye. Maybe it's the car. Tell you what, let's put a painting up here, let them remind them what the outside world looks like. Nice big painting to remind them hey, the outside world is a nice place for the most part. But yeah, I'm not I'm still not getting along with this game too well, <laughs> as you have you noticed. Uh, you know, they tell me they want more water, so I place down a couple more pieces of water and no reaction whatsoever, so it must be there's enough water. I am not sure. Uh, I'm not quite getting it. Uh, I'm just trying to think if there's anything I really want to do up here. Uh, survival. Is there anything I got? So I got a generator downstairs. I got guns and stuff. Where? I thought the safe was in survival. Is that an other? Wow, safe. There we go. Alright, that needs to go downstairs. Uh, actually, I can go right here. Nope. Right there is fine. And the safe is not something they like either. Interesting. I would like to put a chair. You know what? Let's put a sofa down. Not a sofa, but... Uh, uh, this may, That might be too big. Because you can't always lay on the couches. You know, I'm not going to live here. That guy really wants to be a die-hard survival guy. And the other people are like, uh, we'd like a little bit of comfort. <laughs> oh, man. Can't please everyone, I guess. Uh... Okay, I was still looking up. Is this that dark? Just that dark out, I guess. You guys probably can't see crap. So I'm going to go back to <laughs> back down. Uh, Alright, so we got an entryway with water storage. They wanted more, put more in. They didn't care. We got a bed. Kind of like a table. A chair, a couple of TVs so they can keep track of what's going on in the outside world if they want to. Some food storage. I would put more, but... I have a hard time getting stuff on these upper shelves. Uh, so I said the heck with it. I got some pistols here, some M16s hidden there. So if someone breaks in and they open the door this way, it kind of covers the guns. They don't know they're there. Now, I also try to do uh, where the gas mask. Oh, now it late. Oh, wow. <laughs> where was where? So it's got to hang over the edge of the... Alright, whatever. Uh, there. I knew they would probably want some of those, but I couldn't get... Boy, it's real... They got to like hang over the edges, I guess. Alright, so what else? <laughs> Man. Uh... See, I'd like to put the knives up there, but I can't see... Are they up there? No. Alright, how about if I put one... There? We'll just call these, like, hand weapons. So 
So this is kind of like your survival room when you gotta get ready. You got rubber boots, gas mask, your weapons. Some food and toilet paper, your flammables with some water. Hide the first aid kit underneath there. I mean, why wouldn't you? Yeah, I'm just, I'm just not too sure about this at all. I'm not going to bother painting the walls because from what I see, it doesn't matter when I paint the walls or not. No one seems to care. Ever since I got this game, even when you do a house, you paint the wall. Doesn't matter what color you paint it or what kind of wall you're putting up. No one seems to like or dislike the colors of the walls or anything like that. So I'm not really sure if that's part of the game yet or I'm just doing something wrong, which is more likely. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure. All right. Uh, you know what? The heck with it. Uh, let's just see where we're at here. Uh, so I spent 115000 on the house, 115500 My guess is I'm not going to do that well. What? He's a little better at 180? What? Really? Really? Uh, let's negotiate like we always do. Uh, let's negotiate that. Uh, okay. Uh, Alright, we'll accept that offer, I guess. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm not getting it. I'm, well, it must be the achievements are working again. Or there's new ones, I have no idea. No idea. I, I really have no idea what I'm doing in this game, I think. Uh, <laughs> I would say I'm going to throw in the towel, but uh, I know they keep bringing up some updates and uh, improving things. Uh, obviously, I need to improve things myself. I'm not really a designer, obviously. I mean, you've seen my episodes. I mean, look at... I like, I like green walls. Everyone else has probably watched the videos. Every time I come in here, I'm like, oh my god, dude, paint the wall a different color. But, uh, yeah, so that was my first bunker job. And that, uh, at least I got to sell to three different people, which I haven't seen yet. So hopefully I learned some things that they like and obviously things they don't like. Uh, I think I'll have to, next time I do a bunker, is just go all out for the other guy in the gas mask. He just doesn't want no furniture he just wants nothing but pure survival. He wants to lay on a concrete floor with his M16 and a gas mask. So we'll have to do something for him next time. <laughs> but that's going to do it for today, guys, for House Flipper. Uh, I know it's been a while since I've done an episode. I waited for a couple of updates to come out because I was flustered. I kept selling to the same guy. And I realized maybe I kept designing the houses the same way. That's why he kept buying them. So I said, well, I think this time we'll try to do a bunker job and see if I can sell to someone different, which we did. So that's a good thing. So, you know, I'm learning about the game. I'm still not getting along with it a little bit, but I think I learned some things a little bit today, maybe because of the updates, but whatever. But we'll, we'll have to try it again next time. But thanks for watching the episode, guys. Like always, I appreciate you watching. And until the next time, House Flipper, have a good one.